Hi, in this new jazz tutorial, we'll learn an easy technique to accompany and harmonically support a soloist over minor seventh chords. So having done this lesson, we'll learn to comp like this. Imaginary friend, tail, plays the soul. On the grand, we do the comping, improvising the chords. So tail is the soloist. We are the compass. We accompany and complement tail, so to speak. My name is Oliver Pre, by the way, and this is New Jazz Lesson. Okay, for a start, let's focus on the C minor seventh chord. We can expand the chord and do C minor 13. Gathering the notes, we have the thrilling C Dorian mode. And as we've learned in many previous lessons, we can organize the modes by doing a simple pentatonic hand grip. So if we do the C, D, and G minor pentatonic hand grip, we'll fill out C Dorian completely. Mnemonically, we can remember the positions of our hand grip, for example by spacing the grip positions with perfect fifths. Or by recognizing this one, two, five relation. So let's try to use our hand grip at the correct positions to make a C Dorian composition. Because we do several grip positions, we can make movement and progression though we just play a single chord. We can play all hand grip tones to make a thrilling, solid and fat sound. thin out the grip to make a more delicate sound. We can for example settle for doing quartal chord voicings. Look, we can also play the grip tones uh, in turn, like this. Occasionally, we can slide from 
black to white keys to make our sound even more intriguing. This simple C minor seventh comping technique, we can easily transpose and comp over any other minor seventh chord tonality and make chord progressions. Let me show you how. Let's add the D minor seventh chord to our chord sheet. Then we simply move our mnemonic one, two, five positions in C. to the D tonality. And thus we do the expanded D minor 13th chord. Or D Dorian. And now we can easily progress from one thrilling chord to another. Now that's pretty smart, right? same way we can easily add any other minor 7th chord to our chord sheet. So let's try to attach uh, for example uh, the E flat minor 7th chord. Then we simply move our hand grip to the E flat Dorian 1, 2, 5 positions. Now let's try to accompany tail the soloist, or the thrilling minor seventh chords. And thank you so much for being here. Dear musical friends, you can help keep me going by making a small voluntary donation, but you certainly don't have to. All my lessons are free, public and for everybody, money or no money. Many warm regards from Oliver Prey.